Welcome to Top Deck City. My name is Grim, and what I have for you today is a booster brick of well, yeah, booster brick of Hero Clicks uh, Joker's Wild. And the reason why I'm cracking this open is I, you know, I recently saw Suicide the Suicide Squad, and I absolutely loved it. And so I started going through my clicks, and I realized I don't have a lot of Suicide Squad um, team members. And I did some research, and there is a good handful of Suicide Squad members in this particular set. Um, and it's actually not an expensive set. This entire brick was only 60 bucks online. Um, I guess there's not a lot of good pieces in it, but I'm not really in it for like to win it. I'm really just in it to make a cool theme team and have fun. So hopefully uh, I get at least 300 points worth of Suicide Squad members. But we'll see. And uh, so here we go. I'm gonna crack the sucker open. We got one, two, three, four, five, ten packs. Each pack has five clips in it. I'm pretty sure King Shark is not in this set, though. I think he's in the uh, Harley Quinn and the Gotham Girls set, but. I still think I can get Harley Quinn in this set, as well as some of the other, like, uh, <laughs> mediocre Suicide Squad members. Alright. Camera a little bit. Alright, let's see what we got. Hmm. Oh, well, this is a good start. We got Deadshot. <laughs> so, that's awesome. And he is a rare. Um... Oh no, is my Cobra broken? Alright, so we got Deadshot, uh, Court of Owls Initiate, Commissioner Gordon, uh, Cobra, and Harley Quinn. Uh, and it's just an uncommon Harley Quinn. And she does not count as part of the Suicide Squad. So, so far, just Deadshot. I'm going to put him aside. And you can see them in there. I'm gonna pop Deadshot out because I want to. I want to get a closer look at him. So there he is. Pretty sweet looking. I love it. He's I love the costume. He is 75 points. And he's Suicide Squad and Batman Enemy. That's pretty cool. All right, so we'll put him aside. And uh, this guy. Oh, this is like a weird. I remember when they did this with the turtles. The, they did like a black and white thing with the turtles. Um, so Commissioner Gordon there is a like the sketch variant, which I don't personally like. I'd just rather have the figures be in color. But you know what? We'll pull Harley out anyway, even though she technically isn't Suicide Squad. But oh man, it's a tight dial. There we go. And we could always just pretend. All right. Pack number two. I'll have to glue Cobra's hand back on. That kind of sucks that he came broken, but it happens. Miniatures are a little bit different than cards. <laughs> Alright. So, I see... Oh, it's a sketch variant of El Diablo. Alright, let's see what we got here. Let's crack this open. cards and then get the figures out okay so we got el diablo and he is suicide squad so that's sweet the adam um also squad of the society nope uh rachel ghoul uh he's pretty cool looking harley quinn who this harley quinn is also not suicide squad <laughs> and the joker but yeah there's the sketch variant of El Diablo. He actually looks pretty neat. Uh, he's got probability control on his first click. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I like him. 75 points. So we'll put him aside as well. And I guess we'll put the other Harley aside, even though she's also not Suicide Squad. Oh, wait, does this come from him? Check this out. It's like a cool, fiery base to put. Yeah, it's 
pretty sweet. I like that. Pain he has to get out. There's Harley. Got that perplex or is that close combat expert? Hard to see. Okay, pack number three. So off to a pretty good start. I've gotten one in each pack so far. Let's see, I need Amanda Waller. That'd be nice. Um, Captain Boomerang. Although I think he's only in the flash sets. A third Harley Quinn. This one's got to be in the Suicide Squad. Right? Yes, it is. All right. We did it. Three Harley Quinns in a row. Yeah, there she is. Uh, Gotham City Suicide Squad. And then we also got a Two-Face. Vicky Vale. Wildcat. I'm the guy who fights. Anyone who's ever seen uh, Justice League Unlimited. Uh, and Robin. All right. So we'll put this Harley up here and we'll, we'll ditch the other two. Because now we got a proper Suicide Squad Harley Quinn. She's a calculator too, so we can give her the Suicide Squad team ability. I like that. All right. Pack number four. Oh my god, look at that plastic, man. That was the first thing I saw. Oh, oh we got Amanda Waller. So, this is pr pretty awesome. And the red hood. I think the plastic man is either a super rare or a chase. It's hard to see. So we got Robin, Green Arrow, Plastic Man. Oh my god, he's so ridiculous. And what is he? What is his rarity? Uh, the Red Hood, and Amanda Waller. So, let's take Amanda Waller out. There she is. Awesome. But we gotta get a closer look at this plastic man. <laughs> look at this dude. Uh, it looks like he's gold, so I think that's just super rare. Not a chase. Oh, man, he's got stealth. What's his ability here? Look at that wall of text. Oh, my lord. Um, all right. Immeasurable, powerful, absolutely nuts. When Plastic Man is given a non-free non action, choose one. Sidestep, he can become um, tiny. He regular damage or colossal plastic man can use the chosen power or has the chosen symbol until the plastic man chooses again okay so you can make them small big or medium i get it that's kind of fun uh with the new carry rules that's pretty useful you can make them small and then someone else can carry him around uh in the battle all right so that's a four for four on suicide squad members pretty happy about that Sketch variant of Batman. That's depressing. Really don't like these sketch variants. All right, so we got the Spectre. We got Merlin. Um, I believe he was in the Suicide Squad from the comic books. So uh, let's go with Technocrat, Black Lightning, and Batman. So no Suicide Squad. Actual like miniatures are Suicide Squad members, but I am 100% sure that Merlin was in the Suicide Squad in the comics, so I'm just going to put him aside. Pretty sure the character's name is Arthur Knight, also his secret identity. Gotta love DC. <laughs> Number 
number six is oh my god what is that something crazy also some kind of monster in here it's man bat oh man what is this this is exciting oh yeah look at man bat wow let's get a closer look figure is nuts. Would you look at that? Holy moly. That might be one of the coolest figures I've ever opened. Wow. They did a stellar job with this. <laughs> one damage. Alright, well he's got blaze claws, so well there's Man Bat. Uh, I completely lost track of what I was doing. All right, yeah. So there's also there Hawkman, Harvey Bullock, Black Lightning again, and a Joker Thug. Yep, Hawkman, Harvey Bullock, Joker Thug, and Black Lightning. So definitely no Suicide Squad members that time. But that Man Bat is so cool. <laughs> I don't really mind that much. All right, four packs left. That man bat looks like he was a super rare as well. Yeah. So no, no chase figures yet, but two, two super rares. I mean, that's pretty standard for a brick, but if I get a third, I'd be really happy. Oh, boy. All right. So looking in here. Oh, yes. We got Colonel Flag. Sweet. All right. So we got Talon. Um, I don't know this character. Gotham City bad guy. What is he? Court of Owls. All right. Two face actually painted, so that's cool. Colonel Rick Flag, Suicide Squad soldier. Look at him in an awesome yellow shirt. Thanagarian warrior. Okay, that's cool. And a Court of Owls assassin. Oh, okay. So they're like the same guys, so for one dude throwing. Daggers and the other guy isn't. So let's get rid of the flag out of there. Yes. I like how in the movie, too, he is also wearing a yellow shirt. It's not just a plain yellow shirt. It's got like a, I don't know, like an iguana or like an armadillo or something on it. But it's, it's funny that they got him in a yellow shirt for the movie. All right. He was 60 points. And so, uh, you know, for as far as theme teams go, it's just two-thirds of your team has to be um, part of the theme to get credit for it being a theme team. So that's what we're really looking for here. We just want to get two-thirds of the team to be um, Suicide Squad. I think I got something really cool. Well, Jakeem Thunder is a prime figure. Look at that. Keem Thunder, Prime Figure, um, Justice Society, Mystical, Our Man, nice, and Batman Colored In, it's Outsiders Batman, I might put together an Outsiders team, Thanagarian and the Court of Owls Assassin, but this Jakeem Thunder, uh, that's still a super rare, okay, so it looks like I got three super rares so far, the um, Jakeem Thunder, the Man Bat, and who was the other one? Hmm. I already forgot who it was. Oh, Plastic Man, duh. So that's pretty cool. Pretty great brick so far. I'm not complaining at all. And I'm getting a lot of the cool characters that I wanted. I would prefer to get El Diablo in non-sketch non form, but... Alright, last two packs here. I got Rick Flag again. Darn it. And Joker again. Adam again. Commissioner Gordon. And Joker Thug. So nothing new there. Um, that's a bummer. Bunch of dupes. And the last pack. 
far as I could tell, there was still no chase figure. I don't... I'm pretty sure the chase figures are like a bronze color, and the ones I've gotten have all been gold. So... Oh, nice! I see Katana. Oh, and I see Bronze Tiger! Yeah! What a great way to end it here. So we got a Joker, Cobra Fanatic, Katana, yep, there she is, Suicide Squad, awesome, Bronze Tiger, and Robin, oh, the Cobra Fanatic is the sketch variant, and who comes with the, the fire that's in here, 1900 Live or Die, um, Katana, whenever Katana kills an opponent character, choose one to use the rest of the game. Position strike, steel energy, and willpower. That's pretty cool. Drain in your soul. When an opposing character takes damage from Katana's close attack after actions resolve, you may attach the slash marker. Okay, so this is Katana's slash marker. Sweet. Well, I guess I should read what the rest of it does. Um, you may attach a slash marker to that character, uh, removing it from anywhere else. When a character with the slash marker is given an action token, deal it one penetrating damage. When that character heals or clears action tokens, remove the slash marker. Interesting. All right. Yeah, she looks cool. Now she looks even more cool. All right, so I got Katana and Bronze Tiger. got a giant head but he looks cool so I don't care <laughs> all right so now let's see what we got so bronze tiger is 60 points katana is 75 deadshot is 75 Deadshot, uh, okay, Amanda Waller is only 25. Rick Flag is 60. El Diablo is also 75. Harley is 60. Merlin's technically not Suicide Squad, he's 80 points anyway. Yeah, so I think I could actually put the team together here. So what is this? Uh, 60, 120, 180, plus 150 is 230. Um, I only have 70 points to work with. Darn. That sucks. Because they're 75. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, I could ditch this Harley for this 25.1. So then that would be. See, 75, 75, 150, 200. Hmm. And then I'm stuck with 60 again. Darn it. <laughs> this is going to be a lot more difficult than I thought to get a 300 point team. Um, hmm. We got to have Deadshot. I mean, Katana looks so, she's so cool. I like it. The fact that El Diablo has probability control. Man, they're 75 points. Um, Rick Flag is kind of a leader, so it will be what one fifty and one twenty is two, what two seventy, yeah, and then a Waller. Okay, there we go. That would work. That would be uh, that'd be five points off. Okay, so there, there would be my Suicide Squad team. We got um, Rick Flag, Bronze Tiger, Katana, Deadshot, and Amanda Waller. Or Harley Quinn. They're, you could sub them in and out, I guess. It doesn't really matter, but... Rick Flag doesn't start with leadership on his dial. Whereas Amanda Waller does. 
And this Harley Quinn also doesn't count as a Suicide Squad member, so I'd probably still do that. Yep. Yeah, she starts with stealth and leadership. Nobody flies. So carrying people around is going to be tricky. So, anyway, that was uh, Joker's Wild and my Suicide Squad. Hope you enjoyed it.